Well, yeah, just on Danny first. I mean, he, he's not been um, far away at all, obviously, for, uh, um, from the New Zealand tour. He came on the tour. Um, he came into camp in August. And obviously, when it came down to that, uh, uh, that squad, initial squad selection for the Autumn Internationals, um, we felt Steve Marler just had the edge on him. Um, as a consequence, the way the EPS agreement works, uh, um, we couldn't find an opportunity to come into camp. But since then, he's, he's improved his game. He's worked hard. And uh, um, we want to create the opportunity for him and Steve to come in together. Um, obviously, we've got Owen and George as well. Uh, we've got big games at the weekend, um, with both Bath and Saracens playing on Sunday. And, uh, and that has a bearing on it. But equally, it's just a good chance for Danny to, to come in and put a marker down. You know, we've always kept a, uh, an eye on what he's been doing and, and spoke to Chris Robshaw and, and Joe Marler, obviously England captain and his club captain, uh, over the time. Um, but for me, obviously, it was, a, it was a phone call initially and obviously then a meeting. Uh, and uh, I met him one-to-one -one and we had a good chat and uh, we'll go from there. We need, we need the two specialist number eights and Nick, um, to be fair, has been uh, outstanding uh, and uh, uh, deserves his opportunity to to come in and prove that he can replicate that uh, back at international level. So both are in the mix, um, you know, in, in regard to the 10 slot, you know, George and Owen both played extremely well at the weekend. So, um, but uh, we'll see where we go.